the first note is Lincoln Blodgett, the guy who runs a newspaper that no one reads. Now in this video we'll be going through how to get all 10 nerdy rep points. And my pen is 4 is getting range of 50 with the 4 members. Next up, Maximilian Moore, the only doctor in town who refuses to see me. And now it's my roommate, Supernova. Supernova? Whose name is a pun on Supernova, the star exploding or imploding thing. And the leader? Polynomial. Who I believe names a pun of polynomial, perinormal. If you require a quick boost of similar simulation to aid you in your competition of a task, feel free to use this machine. Be safe. Now, unlike any other web groups, I began this playthrough with <laughs> as a nerdy, so all I like web conversation things will be throughout the thing. Also, nerdy trophy nearby the tree. At least none in the garbage can. Now, like all trophies, you can't need, give it to anyone. But if you don't give it to the, but if you don't give it to the leader, then you won't get a web point. And Pony Polly isn't there. <laughs> good thing I. Good thing for video ting editing. Video ting editing. I cannot pronounce words. Of course, it's in the shape of a book. As a token of our abundance and appreciation for our person, please accept this gold plaque and I cannot understand anything she says. Off to something which I can't get. Oh yeah. Now you gain a... Now notice how I have four nerdy rep points. And once you move into some building, you get you can either gain one or lose one if you already have it. Also, don't room with the RC or you'll lose one rep point. How the housing work is very confusing, I cannot find definite answer, so just go everywhere until you gain that point. Salutations, my name is- wait, this is a greeting. Didn't I already say that in some other video? It's like I'm using previous footage or something. Hmm. Salutations, Alice, and welcome to Nerdy Forward. Please accept the silver plaque as a token of our continued support. Your continued su support for our fractionated organization has earned you that subscription to Scientific Simeon. Congratulations! As for your nerdy intonation, we require you to perfect your skill at Dr. Max's stats game. Carve us a chess piece made out of petrified wood and deliver to us 15 giant bog frogs. Good luck. So yeah, got to finish the web mission, the Nodi's web mission. And now back to somewhat, now back to better quality video. Now if you go to like the buy or the dark tunnel, you can find some, you can find a bunch of, find a bunch of the frogs and petrified wood. If it's not here, then like try again next day or something. I believe you can also find them at the graveyard.
and even though it says, and even though that, so apparently you give the frogs a recycling sensor for some reason. As for or as for the other things, well, I like money, so I can buy stuff. Oh yes, now I get the highest motion Dr. Max stats game. To figure out what you need to get to the next motion, just go to select menu, go to your jobs and see what you need. The first you see here is um is of the highest motion. Most level five and not four. The reason because well whenever I get a whenever I get a new jump, I get all the skills needed to get the highest motion, to get more money, so I can buy a bunch of stuff. I like stuff. That's like cornerstone of the Sims games. Buy, wait, live, buy, build. Not so much in this, not so much in the handheld games, but still. So fun and weird how you're operating on a gnome. Gnomes must be special in the Sims universe. Oh yeah. Next, if you don't have a crafting table, you can buy one here. I'm not sure if you need if the mini one works or you need to buy the pro crafting table off the internet. And we have petrified chest piece. Sim go to blah blah blah. Oh, so you might want to save your game before trying this reason. Well, you might fail, you might destroy, or you might make a different thing than what you wanted. Which actually did happen to me. I'm a cowboy. And that's why I saved. I'm surprised you just need to make it and not like give to Pari or anything. Now, I, I re I, now I quite enjoy having a decorative fairy nymph wooden thing as opposed to the chest piece, which despite being made from large wood, it's quite small. Then again, I think the small, I think the like small ones are stuff that I can only use in your pocket like that crate I had. Go, my nymph. Protect my house from um, gnomes. Yes, the evil gnomes that want to steal all my stuff. Now you need to now to get another weapon. You need to max out your logic skill, which you can do so by doing research on a computer. Or if you're lazy, you can just pay for at the university. Or if you're super lazy, just find Hades Channel someone, buy some smoothies. No, I'm not on TV tropes. I'm doing research. Yes. Now the rival leader is Roxy, so you got to annoy her to ship next to five. It can be quite annoying since after, since after a while, since after a while, Roxy will just say, will just tell you to go away, and you have to wait till like the next day or something to tr to continue on. And I really don't like the nerdy walking pose. 
Makes me it makes me a zombie. Do you see zombie in my name? If you said yes to that question, then I have to question your eyesight. As a member of our most exclusive land brain trust in Middle Office, I couldn't invite you to attend our ongoing spelling competitions held every day at the clubhouse. No, I'm currently pursuing my third PhD research in framing of time travel. Shadowing? In honor of your continuing intelligent program, I hereby present you with the key to Nerdy Clubhouse, located in Grasstown. Enjoy this new place, Alice. Speaks with such big words. But yes, when I first played this game, I always wondered what the clubhouse was and what the spelling bee was. I was quite disappointed. But in order to, you, in order to play the spelling bee game, you have to buy the sizzle. Space. Stuff. I don't know. Also, it's just a beat I never got around to get because it's. I never really pass the clubhouse so often. Spelling bee. Now, you remember at the university how you had to basically say if it's one thing or another? Same thing. Except it's spelling, so it's even worse. What's part about this is that there's a time limit. I'm not talking about time limit game. I'm talking about time limit for each ward. Which is why, and which caused me to get nervous, which is why I occasionally say the, it's the wrong thing. And was that last one even a ward? Here I'm watching a summary of YouTube's comments, occasionally good spelling, often not. Now, at the, now here's a notice clip out which mysteriously has a poster of Misty Waters in where I shall dub the bathroom. On the wall, you can see a bunch of nerdy stuff like a map and a rocket ship and an AV closet and a bunch of other stuff. I do enjoy putting a plaque on the other side of the door thing. It's artistic in a way. And here's the mad skills data. Blah, 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 blah. Essentially, if you don't have max skills in everything like I do, you can use this to raise your skills. But since I already have max skills and everything, this proves me no use. Proves me no use. Proves me- 